So always being creative, obviously, is something that's a reoccurring theme and always staying busy and can't turn your brain off because you don't sleep much. Correct. But so I guess the creative side of things just turned into its own separate business away from you doing wedding planning and stuff. It's like, oh, now people start asking me more and more. I may yeah. as well start a business. Yeah. And then it just probably snowballs out of just the fact that you've done it and word of mouth passes and you're yeah. not actively like, hey, I do this. It's yeah. like, oh, Rachel's great at this. Hire her. Call her. Yeah. Yes. I get a lot of that like you know, somebody reaches out to me and they're like, oh, Kent told me about you. And I'm like, oh, great. So it's, it Kent is, again? yeah, <laughs> huh, what? That's uh, which it's always so flattering to, you know, get that phone call of somebody's recommended yeah. you, but it is, it's, it's a good thing. Cause I am kind of to the point where I get to choose the projects I want. Mm -hmm. And I know that's really hard to get there for a lot of people. Yeah. So I've had to kind of force myself to do that too, because I say yes to everybody. Um, but so now I'm trying to like tame that down a little bit and focus on the projects that really mean something. Yeah. Well, yeah. so 21 C is obviously, that's <sighs> a big project. God, that was incredible. Right? That was a, um, they were renovating Marietti's lounge yeah. and I get this email and I thought it was, or no, I guess Melanie called, left me a voicemail and I thought it was a joke. Like, Oh, they've called the wrong person. I'll call her back and, you know, connect her to somebody that she's mm -hmm. actually looking for. And no, they were looking for me. And so set up a meeting, came in and met with them. And that was one, I think we met on a Monday and I did a presentation to show them everything on like that Thursday. They were moving very quick. Um, which again, I'm kind of glutton for punishment. Like I love, I don't know if I let, I'm just drawn. I don't know what it is yeah. to big projects. I love a good challenge, I guess. Easy stuff bores me. Um, so this was a massive undertaking. They, while they were renovating Mary Eddie's, they wanted to transform that round room, mm -hmm. one of their galleries into a full immersive experience for their new dining area yeah. while that one's getting renovated. And so I wish I would have counted how many hours, but made it into this uh, like rainforest tropical theme. And it was such an incredible project. It was great to work with them. They were so much fun. And then just to see everybody interact with it was was really great. Yeah. Well, to have a space that like, you know, people come into from out yeah. of town or people in town go and have a drink there. And I yeah. mean, it's, it's cool to be, you know, it's great to do things, but to do, pla to do things in places where a lot of people are going to yeah. see it. Right. And, yeah. and just to kind of have that personal kind of gratification of like, yeah. I did that. Yeah. And even though no, you know, people coming in and passing might not know you're like, but you I know. know, but I know. Yeah. Right. And then that yeah. gives you the confidence to go on and do something else, especially when you tackle something that's not, you know, at the time, like this is a project, this is quite yeah. a big deal. You know, it seems a stretch at the time, but then you go on to knock it out of the park and like, oh, I can do this. I got this. And then you just keep climbing the steps yeah. until you do yeah. something, you know, mega. Yeah. So. It's the goal. And um, that was, I think that was the really cool thing after it was done, having dinner there and like taking my brother and his family and my nieces and nephews and his wife there. That was so cool to see these tiny kids be like, oh, this is cool. Yeah. I mean, they don't really understand the whole, you know, everything, but they knew that I created it, but it was just like, oh yeah, you know, getting to see it through somebody else's eyes is definitely really yeah. cool.